Vivo's growth in the Indian smartphone market has been unprecedented and to reaffirm its position as an innovation leader, the company held its first ever Technology Day in India this week. The company is focused on three key verticals and it emphasized that through technology demos centered around foldables, imaging and 5G. Vivo's flagship foldable steals the show with its unique aspect ratio that makes it more pocketable than other products on the market. Moreover, Vivo claims that the Vivo Fold is the first to pass the TUV Rhineland Reliable Folding Certification and the Aerospace Grade Screes rated for 300,000 unfolding cycles. That's up to 10 years of use with 80 folds and unfolds every day. The company is also doubling down on its imaging credentials with the Vivo V1 Plus chip. We've already seen it in the Vivo X80 series and the chipset is designed to improve image quality and enable high-end features like image upscaling and better video quality. Combined with the company's Zeiss collaboration, users can expect better photos all around. Your journey started off with Nokia and here we are many, many years later now with Vivo. Can you take us through what was dramatically different at that time? I mean, it was revolutionary then too, what you did with Nokia. But now what you're doing is absolutely game-changing. Quickly just take us through the entire journey. Yeah, we started 16 years ago with Nokia, as you said, and uh, that was, I would say, the childhood of mobile imaging. And at that time, it was racing imaging. So um, by every year, it was uh, the task was to increase the pure image quality, getting better uh, rapidly. But now, uh, since several years, it's changing dramatically. The general quality level of uh, mobile phone imaging is reasonably good. But now um, you bring the fine details, uh, new stuff like bokeh styles and things like that uh, you couldn't think of 10 years ago. But now we are on a level where you can do things that were um, exclusively to system cameras in the past. Finally, Vivo users can expect to be fully 5G compatible by the end of November. The phones are also compatible with Geo's cloud gaming platform suitably named Geo Games Cloud to enable high quality interactive experiences over 5G.